we will be looking at the gaseous state chapter. For this chapter, you will be expected to draw, be able to draw graphs. So I'll be teaching you how to draw the graphs today. So for example, if you are asked to sketch a graph of uh, PV over T against either PV or T, this is what you do. First, uh, make use of this equation, PV equals to NRT. Make sure that whatever is on the y-axis is on the left-hand side. So just bring it over to the left, PVT equals to NR. Since this is a constant, it means that PV over T equals to a constant. So therefore, if you plot uh, the, the x-axis as either PV or T, it will be a straight line. Okay, another example, PV equals to NRT. If you're asked to sketch PV against T, put the y-axis on the left-hand side. So therefore, this will be a, a normal straight line where it's equals to your y equals to mx graph, where this is your x and this is your y. Okay, so you get a normal graph with a straight line cutting through the origin. So let's look at some other examples. PV equals to nrt. Uh, they want p versus v, so I put the p equals to nr. T one over V. Now, now this will be similar to your Y equals to one over X graph. So th therefore you will have a P against V will be an inverse relationship. Okay, because of how it looks like. Next, let's try again. P V equals to NRT. They want P against one over V. So P equals to NRT. 1 over v, this will be your y, this will be your x axis. So p against 1 over v will be a straight line cutting through the origin. Another example, p v equals to nrt. They want v as the y axis, so v on the left hand side equals to nr over p, t. So therefore, v against t will be your straight line cutting through your origin. One last one, uh, similar V against T, but this is in terms of degrees Celsius. So PV equals to NRT, V equals to NR over P, T. This T is in terms of Kelvin. So if I change it to degrees Celsius, this will be T in terms of degrees Celsius plus 273. Okay, the temperature in terms of degrees Celsius plus 273 will be your temperature in terms of Kelvin. So therefore, we will put V as your y-axis and temperature in terms of degrees Celsius as your x-axis. We can rewrite this as okay, so this will be your y equals to mx Plus C, this will be your C. So this graph will be shifted upwards. It will still be a straight line graph, but it will be shifted upwards. Where you have V against T in terms of degrees Celsius. When V is zero, this will be minus 273.15. So this is how you sketch a graph for a gaseous state chapter. Now this one in your chemistry. See you the next time. Mm -hmm.